wanted to show something I always thought was interesting. I've passed by it several times over the years. But there is a former... Now tell me, I'm going to put that there. What is that sign used to be? Well, if you said Blockbuster, you're correct. There used to be a Blockbuster here, and I guess they decided to just repurpose the sign and turn it, uh, call it Jay's Liquor. Now, the Blockbuster, I think I remember seeing it. I think it was there. But the liquor place is like over here somewhere. So, now there's like a Dollar Tree where I think, I'm, I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong. That's where, the, but I'm pretty sure the Blockbuster was there. It's been so many years, I don't know. It could be wrong. But I wanted to show that. It's going to be a really short video. I think that's kind of cool. Kind of like a, you know, a blast from the past type thing. With Blockbuster being gone, even though I've heard that they're starting to come back a little bit. Which is really cool. I mean, it's just one of those things from my ch when I was younger. I remember Blockbuster. You know, I never really got a chance to rent really any movies there. It was always like a local video rental place when I was younger. It was never really a Blockbuster around where I lived. But, uh, yeah, that's a former Blockbuster sign. I think it's cool, kind of like old Americana stuff that's, like, left over. Repurposed. They easily could have knocked that thing down. It looks like a, basically a ticket stuff. That's what it's supposed to um, look like. So, yeah, I think this is kind of cool. Just wanted to show it. All right, nice watching. Oh, this is in, uh, I believe this is Lakeland, Florida, in case you want to know. That street, I think, is, like, 92 or something like that. Yeah, let's cross from the 7-Eleven. There's a Harvey's there and the McDonald's right there. So if you want to find it, that's where it is. I think or just look up Jay's Liquors. Jay's Liquor. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye, everybody. Bye.